Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. When the puppy is growing, he is using lots of calcium for teeth development, the teething phase. This means that a lot of calcium is being directed towards the teeth, and not to the ears. This means that your corgi's ears can be floppy one week, stood up the next, and even not at the same time. Take our lead. Corgi pups aren't born with upright ears, but rather with drop ears that lie flat. As they mature, usually starting around 8 weeks of age, the ears may slowly begin to rise. Note that some pups will never develop upright ears and they may remain drop ears for their entire lives. Make your mark, take our lead. It may surprise you, but most Pembroke Welsh Corgis are born with full-length tails like the one pictured above. It's not uncommon for people to assume that Corgis are born with short, stubby tails because most people have only seen tail-less Pembroke Welsh Corgis.27 May 2020. Take our lead. Corgi pups are born with large floppy ears that fold down. Growing puppies may need a little help with getting their ears to raise, which is why many pups have to have their ears taped. Taping also helps to increase circulation through the ears. The AKC states that uprighted ears for corgis is the breed standard. 23 January 2020. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.